Welcome back to Girl Talk. We're filming today on location at the Great Dane Pub here in Hildale. Now, actually, it's the Great da Dane Pub and Brewing Company. Such a long name, and I'm so used to just saying Great Dane. <laughs> More commonly known as the Great Dane. More commonly known. Madison. With us we have Megan, she's the bar manager, and she said it's okay if we just call it the Great Dane. <laughs> she told us. Thank she you. told us. <laughs> Thanks for joining us. Thanks for having us here today. Oh, yeah. I have to say I've been here before, but never all the way back here. I had no idea just how big this place really is. Huge. Very deceiving, and it's fabulous. Mm -hmm. I love that you have li little different nooks and, yes. and areas that might suit your event, your night, your guest, mm -hmm. your company, Absolutely. that kind of thing. I love yeah. that. Mm -hmm. But today we're here actually to talk about two events you have coming up. Mm -hmm. One of them, if your Valentine is a beer lover, listen up. You've got Bachfest coming up. Now you've done this event for a while now, but this year is a little different? Um, this year we are actually collaborating with more breweries that are coming in. Um, in the past, uh, especially last year, we ourselves brewed over 20 beers to have on tap for Bachfest. Um, but this is the biggest one yet that we are going to be having. The brew house is going to be open. Uh, we usually do some sort of hammer schlagen in there. The brewers are there on site to talk with you, Very answer cool. any questions. You get to try everything from all these breweries. Um, we've got Carbon 4, Lakefront, Wisconsin Brewing Company all those people here. Awesome. So. And the yeah. reason that I mention your Valentine is because this is taking place on Saturday, February 11th. Ah. So this could be a fun treat um, because not only are, is there beer, but other things as well I'm sure you'll tell us about. Oh yes. Awesome. Um, we have, let's see, we do giant pretzels. Um, the kitchen <laughs> Everybody does. loves a giant pretzel. I do. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> um, the kitchen cooks up some Bavarian style pretzels to soak up all that beer that people are drinking all day, mm -hmm. um, which definitely helps you keep ingesting more, so. <laughs> I yeah. love that, I love that. So I kind of have a silly question, it may be a stupid question since you're a beer master. What is a Bach beer? So a Bach beer is typically a dark German style oh, beer. Okay. Um, and the origin itself is a little mysterious, but Ooh. we kind of tend to think about it um, as a symbol for better times to come and to say goodbye to winter. Oh, I yeah. like that. I like See you that later, for sure. <laughs> See you later. Our darker beers, they tend to be stronger or not necessarily? Yes. Okay. Um, especially Bach beers, they are going to be higher on the ABV scale. So you got to watch what you're drinking. Don't drink too much. You can sample everything. You so. might have to have two pretzels. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> or just for fun if you just want to. All right, so let's um, talk a little bit more about what's actually going on. You mentioned the Bavarian pretzel bar. Um, and that you have the largest sampling of Bach beers in Wisconsin, or Madison at least, that I had read. And there's raffles? Yes. Um, Rob Labreglio, who is the vice president and our brew master per se for all the locations, he runs it here. He does raffles. Um, all the breweries that come, especially us, we put together certain prizes from our gift shop or promotional gift certificates to hand awesome. out to people for these raffles and he definitely brings a lively face to the crowd, so. Awesome, all right. Yeah. Cool so stuff. this is gonna be on February 11th from 12 to five, and that's a Saturday. Yes. Okay. Awesome, Got a great it. day to come out, for sure. Of course, especially in February when it's <laughs> so cold. So. Definitely, you'll definitely need to stop by. Yeah. And I wanna talk about another event too. You guys also have a kid disco. Do you have to be a kid to enjoy everything at the kid disco? Gosh, no. Um, we welcome all parents, the bar is open. We have just about everything you could imagine. Um, the 70s music that DJ Nick Nice plays is not only kid friendly, but it's got some groovy tunes to it. Groovy. Yeah, I like that. definitely groovy. Um, parents and even the staff, you can find dancing around with people having fun. Maybe even people that aren't parents. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> I was saying that I might have to come check it out. Ellen, you and I can go. <laughs> yes. And when we're there, we're going to enjoy, you have a bubble machine for this event. What else? Oh, yes. So we have an open dance floor for the kids. We've got bubble machine. <laughs> then we so fun. <laughs> Um, definitely the main attraction, but we also have Funny Faces does a lot of stuff for us. So we do balloon sculptures and face painting. Um, we just had Santa Claus this past one. Oh, so, how much fun. Yeah, a lot And this of fun. is every other Saturday starting in January? Correct. And the next one is February or January 7th, which is next week. Awesome. All right, full cool. disclosure here, I am a fan of the animal balloon sculptures. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Anything That's else so you want to add about that event? Um, that no. covers it. Yeah, that pretty much covers it. A lot of fun. Mm -hmm. awesome. so. so 
You know, going back to the Great Dane, you guys have so many different locations. And before the show, we were talking about food and drinks. <laughs> and I want to know, what is your favorite Great Dane entree? Oh my gosh. Because there's so um, many to choose from. I don't know how you can pick just one. There are so many to choose from, but my favorite is probably the Chipotle chicken quesadillas. Oh, and we just yum. changed it a little bit, um, which is even better. A little Ooh. bit of spice, some Chipotle barbecue over the top to die for. Oh, you also a mentioned one. a soup. The tomato That's my and favorite. mushroom bisque, yes. Okay. Great I, winter. I was mentioning before the show started that I have this really weird obsession with tomato soups. I love tomato soup. I love making homemade tomato soups. Mm -hmm. And that, I think, was actually one of the first things I ever had from the Great Dane, because oh I'm gosh. somewhat new to the area. Mm -hmm. um, I've been with Girl Talk now for about eight months, and that was about when I came to the Great Dane for the first time, because oh, everybody yeah. was like, you have to go to the Great Dane. Yeah. I was like, what, what's the Great Dane? <laughs> and it was phenomenal. Did oh, you have right. grilled cheese with it? I have to ask. I don't think I did. I'm not oh. as big of a fan of grilled cheese as I am of soup. I did have another sandwich though. I don't remember what it was, but it was yummy. To me, they go hand in hand, the grilled, grilled cheese and the tomato, tomato soup. <sighs> they are Should a great we give pair. a shout out to your other locations? Yeah, so we've got locations in Fitchburg, downtown. Uh, we also have a Wausau location and an awesome. east side location. Oh. So the one in Everybody Fitchburg is go. the Cahill Main area. Correct. Where is it downtown? On East Doty Street, which is right off the square, pretty much. Okay. Yeah. The classic Great Dane. The original <laughs> one, yes. Really? I feel, yeah. I, maybe because I live in this area, I was feeling like this was the original one. Oh, I wish, but And nope. then your East Side one? East Side is the newest location that just opened up. Awesome. So, Where, yeah. And whereabouts is that? Um, the East Side one is going to be... No, I can't remember. I the caught you off guard. Yeah, <laughs> these are your digs right here. Type it into your Google yeah. Maps. You've all got a phone in front of you. Type it into Google. You'll be set. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Well, Megan, thank you so much. These two events sound great. It's Bachfest, which is in February, and then every other Saturday for the kids' disco. Don't disco. have to be a kid. Don't yeah. have to Sounds be. Sounds great. Thanks for filling <laughs> us in. Thank Thanks, you. Megan. Thanks to all of our guests. Thank you for watching, and from us at Wisconsin 57. Happy New Year. We'll see you next time on Girl Talk.